What's going on guys? This is Bryce from Comical Penguin. We're back with a, another episode of our uh, Fire, the, Fire Year of the Dragon Let's Play. We're going to start off here in Crystal Island. Man, how do you, you believe how upset I would have been if I had quit that? <laughs> yeah, we're going to start here. Um, yeah, it's really Crystal Island. Um, yeah, we're getting towards the end of our, uh, end of our Spiral of the Dragon playthrough here. Um, yeah. And that part, I mean, at least, um, the first part of our Spyro series. I mean, we probably won't come back and, I mean, at some point I'd like to come back and play the, uh, They're like remakes after awesome like controllers I dying. Anyone, but we were stolen some magic from the sorceress. We're hiding here whilst we are practice using it. Unfortunately, we've had the beat of an accident and turned everything into crystal, and it seems to have aggravated the indigenous creatures. <laughs> oh, that that's something there, bro. And Oh, look at that little thing. Oh my goodness, it's... Okay, I see you here. <laughs> Good try, bud. Do you see that thing over there, Spartans? <laughs> Easy enough. Oh, there's quite a few eggs in here. Hey there, buddy. Do you like to see a magic trick? Watch carefully. As you can see, there is nothing up my left sleeve and nothing up my right sleeve. But now, with a wave of my hands and the magic word, Alakazam! Oh. I must say, that is quite the magic trick. Oh, look at that thing. <laughs> I can make that one, right? See the trick again? Well, all right, but I want you to know this isn't as easy as it looks. Alakazam! <laughs> I'll try. Not <clears throat> I will try not to come back and play again, but. Should it be my last time through Great Zamboni. <laughs> all this magic is just misdirection, you know? Which is why I'm going to start that whirlwind over there. Abracadabra! Oh, my God. 
Got him. Okay, I'll show you again. If you watch carefully, <laughs> maybe you'll be able to see how it's done. Abracadabra! I'm not even trying to open. Oh, well. Completely honest, I'm not even concerned how it's done. Spyro, did you know I happen to be a very talented amateur magician? My specialty is the uh, amazing <coughs> extending bridge trick. I'd love to show you, but I'll need a small donation first. For my expenses, you understand. Sure, my bags. Very good. Ha, ah, let's see. Hocus pocus, ziggledy zen. Make this bridge get long again. Yeah. Not fishy at all there, dude. <clears throat> well, I suppose I could show you my new trick. As long as you promise not to tell the great Zamboni, he steals all my best work. Alakazam! Say, uh, smart to look alive there, bud. Look at that thing. Well, miss one. I could... uh oh well that stinks I have to go back and redo this whole thing again put that flying beaver with like not where I could see him earlier well, we may have a few more episodes than we have Initially, uh, thought we would, to be honest. Come on, dude. Well. You almost had me there, bud. going to use it in a trick, but uh, my magic, it just keeps bouncing off. It's an egg. Oh, hey there. <laughs> See ya, bud. There's the magic right there, right? Hmm. Oh, I see. Got an old friend here, don't we?
Missed him. Got him. <laughs> Not another one, is there? Nope. Grace. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, see there, that's not taking me back to the beginning. Amazing Rendini is about to put on a display of prestidigitation. I've heard it's quite impressive, so I'm going to watch the show. Have fun. Pretty good on. I am afraid my magic show seems to have overexcited <laughs> the moles. All they need is a good bonker on the head to calm them down. And you look like just the yeti to help. A light tap on the head should sort them out. But be careful, my friends are trying to burrow after them. Go bash some gnomes. I'm nowhere near where I need to be at. Come on, dude. Come on. 
No, I, I get that I need a light tap on the head. How many freaking times do I have to freaking aim at him before it's like... Come on. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. This is such a dumb game. Just let it go. Yeah, I'm gonna lose this one again too. I literally need two to pop up. Thank you for... I mean, that's so dumb. That is so dumb. That is so dumb. But the first 10 seconds, there are none. So immediately, you make me lose on purpose. Yep, I lose again. Awesome. I literally needed one more. This is one of the dumbest games. Like, why is this timed? Why is this timed? And why are the first 10 minutes of the timed event, there are none? Great. None. Not one to be found. This is awesome. This is stupid. This is such a dumb game. He's literally right beside the freaking gnome. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do there? You can't freaking run. Awesome. That's screwed. God, that's so stupid. Games like this, games like this are a waste of time. What a waste of time.
I'm so glad I lose because this is timed. It is one of the dumbest timed events. Why is it the timed event? Why is it the timed event? Bro, you can go screw yourself. <laughs> Come on. I hate it. I really do hate this the time of it. This is literally one of the dumbest timed events. <laughs> this is such a stupid timed event. This is such a dumb timed event. Like, why is there a timer? Why is there a freaking timer on someone who cannot run any faster? Dude, come on. See, they've got themselves all over top. Shut up, dude. Shut up. Dude, your dumb friends should not be friends, co-workers, why are they coming after them? Stop dick! I am so mad. It is so dumb that they literally run right right towards my bash. Great, and I miss. Awesome. I can't. I literally don't even get anything in the first 15 seconds. I haven't gotten anything in the first 15 seconds. Immediately screwed. This is a dumb. Dumb. Dumb mini game. And then I don't see anything for freaking three seconds. This is the stupidest mini game. Like, why is this a thing? I hate these freaking gnomes.
Awesome. Are we serious? How did I even hit him? I did not hit him. It makes no sense. Just the stupidity of this freaking event. Dude, I'm restarting immediately. That is so dang dumb. <sighs> wow, I'm glad I'm wasting my time. Dude, stop pushing me. Dude, you need to tell your dang friend to stop being over here. <laughs> I hate these. I hate these freaking gnomes. I hate these gnomes. These gnomes are stupid. They make they make this so much less enjoyable. This is not a fun game. Like this dude right here. Why the frick do you feel the need to push me around? And there's this idiot. He's running around and they don't even do anything. They're not helping. They're literally just a hindrance. There we go. Thank goodness. Dude, I don't even care. I don't want to talk to you again. I don't want to see you again. You are literally have one of the dumbest mini games I have ever played. Just such a dumb, dumb, dumb mini game. Well, I, I mean, there's. An, I do not understand. <clears throat> the purpose of a mini game, where there are literally people who you cannot. There are just so many of them who are doing nothing. Just a waste of time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the nice thing about this is that Sparks is. I don't even need to worry about those. Sparks is literally just going to be able to get them. 
which is actually really nice. Nice. Well, I mean, I know that that's an overly easy mini game, but I'm glad there was an easy one after the like ridiculously difficult one. <laughs> that last one was not fun, not a fun mini game. Wow, this is a long loading screen. There it is. Yeah, I'm gonna go up to Desert Ruins now, I guess. I think I got enough time to do this one. As long as we don't have a stupidly hard uh, mini game, it should be fine, right? Also, I was playing this game as a kid. I thought that main, like the the main world there, was bigger than it is. <laughs> oh my goodness! Hello, you must be Spyro. I've heard a lot of people talking about all the things you've done for them. <laughs> Do you think you could help find my girlfriend Tara? She went off to raid the tomb of the stone god. But I haven't seen her since. I'd go look inside the tomb myself, but. You know, there's all these scorpions. Yeah, dude. Definitely. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that doesn't look like it's supposed to be touched. Oh, that thing's huge. Oh, wow. Got him. Ha. Oh, my goodness. How in the world did you plan that out? Like, explain that one to me. I'll be honest, I didn't realize. Yep, that's so dumb. So when did they do that? <laughs> Not loving this. Not loving this at all. Yeah, I'm not wasting my time doing this anymore. There's a way to get up there. I'm guessing it's gonna be from across that way. Awesome, so I really am not loving.
Yeah, I know you're gonna basically lead me to the end of it, right? But I will do that later. Oh, come on, Sparks. Seriously, dude. I say sparks grab your lizard like come on dude okay at least we're making progress here right good try there bud I do applaud your effort. Fortunately for you, it's too little too late. But I do applaud it still. Awesome. I'm so glad I immediately can't. <sighs> well, that's dumb. That's actually kind of dumb. This is actually kind of annoying. <sighs> like, do I actually think I can make it from here? No, I do not think I can make it from here. <sighs> this is so dumb. This is so dumb. Come on. I'm not getting so mad right now. Dumb. <sighs> I'm 
money bags over here. Well, Spyro, I bet you're glad to see me. It just happens that I know the uh, password to open the door to the tomb of the stone golem, but it seems to have slipped my mind for the moment, if you know what I mean. Yeah, 800. Uh -huh. Very well then, the password to <laughs> open the tomb is... Are you ready? <laughs> Gullible. I bet it was. Oh, that's dumb. That's really dumb. I, I really am just loving all of this stuff, dude. I guess I'm gonna come back and do all these again. up here to raid the tomb after I've done all the hard work. I've spent all day pressing switches and shoving boxes around, and you just waltz in here <laughs> expecting to claim the treasure. Well, you might as well have it. It's only a lousy egg anyway. I didn't get it that moment until <laughs> it's t Tara, Tara, like Lara Croft. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Oh, well. Okay. Oh, weird. Where? I guess there's... I don't know. We're going over here to help out uh, old, old Sheila. <laughs> Sheila Kangaroo, right? Go Hi, and Sheila. I haven't seen you in a while. I'm just off for a bit of a walkabout right now. You know, sometimes you just long for the simple, old-fashioned pleasures of yesteryear, don't you? Absolutely, Sheila. Well, that's dumb. I am already not loving it. I do like the, uh, the, the throwback. I do like the old throwback. Like, oh yeah, look at this. Whole... <coughs> the... Oh, that's so nice.
Oh, come on. Sheila, come on, you stupid. <laughs> Calm yourself, dude. Well, that's super cool. I love that I lose. Oh, good. I'm literally without sparks now. Awesome. Yep. That's just... This is... I... Oh, I hate this crap so much. I hate this BS. I hate crap like that. Oh my, if I had literally fallen in there because of that crap. Ugh, this is so stupid. I really do hate this game. Freaking grab your butterfly, you idiot. I do like the, uh, the throwback to the old to an old 2D platformer. Well, I hate that crap. I think that's stupid. I think that's really stupid that you defeat all these enemies and then they put them right back on the field. That is such a dumb, dumb mechanic. Dumb mechanic. Thank goodness they're not over here. Oh, they are. They actually are over here. That's so dumb. Such a dumb way to make a game. Such a dumb way to make a game. Yes, I am a butterfly hunter. Thanks for pointing that out. Oh, yes, I, I, I do. I know, sorry. I know that the uh, gems are over here because literally the only place where it makes sense for there to be gems. <clears throat> oh, what in the world? Get out of my way, you stupid. I've been training my new pet manta ray to carry the latest technology. Super high impact underwater missile launchers. Want to ride them and try blasting some sharks? Absolutely. Watch out for shark riders. They're carrying the latest JX5 underwater tracking ammunition. Come on, dude. Try not to ready to try dude, right shut up. up. <laughs> this is the dumbest thing ever. This is so stupid.
This is so dumb. This is such a dumb mini game. Another dumb one. Great, I can't even, literally. Oh, I am so mad right now. I'm actually really ticked. <laughs> actually kind of stupid. This is actually kind of. This is actually stupid. Nice shooting, comrade. Where'd you learn to aim like that? Oh, by the way, <laughs> Bianca wanted me to give you this egg. She says she accidentally turned it into a woolly mammoth for five minutes, but it should still be okay. What? I will definitely will. <clears throat> I think I already did everything I needed to do. Wow, I mean... This is going to be pretty close to the end of this episode, guys. I mean, if I can figure out how to get off this thing first. But yeah, I mean, that's actually the... You can ride the manta ray around. Okay. By the way, if you see Bianca around... Can you tell her to meet me here? I, uh, promised I'd give her scuba lessons once the sharks were gone. Sure thing, Hunter. <laughs> but, I mean, that's gonna be the end of our episode today, guys. Um, we're making good progress in this game. <laughs> I was hoping to get at least another one done before the end of this, uh, episode, but hey, you can't always get what you want. Um, but yeah, we will, uh, pick back up in this game tomorrow. Um, maybe it's Hunter Towers next, I guess. But yeah. <laughs> start on that one uh, next time uh, I'm not sure how many more worlds we have in this one uh, for I honestly don't think it's that many to be honest oh yeah it's only yeah so it's only only a few more so we'll probably try to do at least those next three uh tomorrow um but yeah we'll see y'all then bye guys